This is pure American history. Provincetown, Massachusetts. This is where the Pilgrim Fathers first set foot on American soil in the year 1620. It's also where Marvin Hagler pitches camp when he's in training, and he's done it for years. Now, Provincetown is on that little finger of land that juts out from the eastern seaboard, known as Cape Cod. And Provincetown is right on the tip of the little finger. It's a fishing village, an artist colony, and a famous resort, but not in midwinter. Right now, it's a ghost town. It's bleak, the wind comes howling in off the Atlantic. But this is where Hagler trains. He lives in a virtually empty hotel. The dining rooms are shut, the bars are closed, the corridors are empty. But there, Hagler sits like a hermit in an empty hotel in a ghost town. Well, there's nothing ghostly, of course, about 28-year-old Hagler's record. It's there in cold print for all to see, and it's very impressive. He's lost only twice. He easily beat the men who beat him in return fights. He's never been stopped, amateur or pro. And he claims that nobody in 59 professional fights has ever put him on the floor. The statistic that sums up the menace lying in wait for Tony Simpson is that the last time Southpaw Hagler was beaten was one month before Simpson turned professional seven years ago.